Everything's okay here. Steffi's asleep. Oh, that's wonderful news. It's not all good. On one of Steffi's scans, there was a blood clot in her brain. It should break up on its own, but until then, she can't be upset or excited. I thought she was okay. She will be. You're helping Steffi save her marriage. You're providing your hospital with a state-of-the-art cardiac facility. This is Steffi's scan now. The information you're giving the other patient, her family, about the blood thinners and the loving, nurturing environment, et cetera, et cetera, you're giving that same information to my son. All right. I'll be home soon. But... Liam, you look troubled. Just tired. Need to get some rest. Steffi's gonna need all your attention when we get back to LA. Is this a bribe? I think if I wanted to bribe you, I would have brought you champagne. <laughs> oh, you know me so well. I hope I do. Yesterday, Jackie, I asked you to take me back. I want to be your husband again. I need you. I need your answer. I'm sure that she, she wouldn't be surprised. Come on, Jackie, why do you think that she's been taking things so slowly? There's nothing wrong with the period of courtship, and, and certainly Bridget deserves to be romanced. And I agree. But I'm not the guy to do that. Because I have always been, and I always will be, badly in love with you. Steffi can't get excited. What could happen? A stroke. Hey! Where's Ridge? He's not back yet. He's on his way. I asked Madison. Steffi okay? Well, she has a blood clot in her brain, and it's not affecting her right now, but it could be very dangerous. It's terrible. Is there anything that we can do? Well, no, no, there's not that right now. All right, then. Let's tackle something that we can solve. Well, honey, the meeting has been postponed. Yeah, every day we sit on the sidelines, we lose money. We lose a lot of money. We need to get back in the game, and we need to replace that line that Jackie stole. And it just so happens, I've got one right here. Who did these? I did. Have you and Hope had a chance to talk, even? Not really. Well, we won't be landing for a while, Thomas. Fly all the way to Alaska, I wouldn't have enough time to explain. Please, you do not have to rush back. I have got everything under control. Completely under control. You enjoy yourself. I'll, I'll just see you later, okay? Okay, bye. <sighs> Finally. I, 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 I'm trying to run a business. And I'm just trying to save our marriage. <sighs> Look. Oh my, this is 
sweet. It's flattering, but I just... But Jackie, I want our life back. Your life is with Bridget and Logan now. And they are a huge part of my life. Yes, and I love them both. And every, every moment that I spend with them as a family is precious to me. But so is every moment that I spent with you. You ended our marriage so that I could become a better father. So that I could spend more time with Logan and so that I could be a bigger presence in his life. But Jackie, I can't be completely present with him if a huge part of me is always longing for you. Simply being around isn't going to make me a better father to him. He needs me at my best. And I've never been better than I was with you. Come on, Rick. Call me, call me. What did they say? Rick, these are very impressive. Thank you. I've never seen you do anything like this. I've been working on them for a while. I've finally found my muse. This is really kind of surprising. You've never done anything but the business end. Brand development, sales, and now... Well, right now, we don't have anything to sell. Eric and Ridge are working as fast as they can. Well, yes, they've come up with a few new designs, and they've altered some of the gowns that Jackie M stole. But I gotta be honest, they're beautiful, but there's no cohesion. And if there's anything you taught me, Dad, you can't throw a bunch of dresses together and call it a line. You know, all of our collections have a focus. They have a theme that is expressed through every piece that ties the whole thing together. And these, these designs do that. And they do it very well. It's not our usual style. If you want to get people talking, you got to do something new. Something that's uh, unexpected. <laughs> a collection worth waiting for. Yes, but we don't have months to market it. We gotta create a buzz, we gotta get people talking. These designs will certainly do that. I have more. The pattern makers can start on this group. I can have a full collection in production by the end of the week. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. Come on, wait a minute now. Ridge is the CEO of this company and he's the only person that makes the decisions as to what goes into production. It wasn't your call to make, Thomas. Hope and I were enjoying ourselves. I didn't want anything to ruin that. Oh, so you admit that you and Stephanie manipulated this. Liam, I told you to drop it. I just, I just want to know what happened. I didn't know Stephanie was going to be there. Actually, when, when we first ran into each other, she talked about leaving, but the resort was so beautiful, and she and Liam, they were already having such a great time. I thought we were too. So did I. It was a regrettable decision, Thomas, and let's just leave it at that. Thomas, what about that proposal? Was that a regrettable decision? No. Well, the only thing I regret is you didn't say yes. So it wasn't part of your plan. Steffi didn't have anything to do with it. She helped with some of the arrangements. The picnic on the beach. The ring. What? Hope. My proposal was real. Everything I said to you was true. And those were your words or my wife fed them to you? All right, that's enough. This is pointless. And it's certainly not helping Steffi. Do you have any idea what this kind of negativity could do to her? I, if she heard what you were saying? Yeah, what? You I'm... need to change your attitude ASAP. This clap, it could be there for months. In the meantime, she needs all the love and support of everyone around her, especially you.
trying to replace the designs of Jackie Amstel. I should have been told about that ridge. I do own 12.5% of Forrester Creations. What are you doing to protect my investment? The only thing we can do, Bill. Put together another collection as soon as possible. We can't drag our feet. Decisions need to be made in ridges in here. He'll be home today. Will he be in the office? Or will he be out in Malibu with Steffi? I'm not blasting the guy. If I was in his position, I was in his shoes, I'd be with my kid. He'll be here if we need him to. We don't. Dad founded this company. He greenlit every collection we ever produced until Ridge took it over. So what do you say, Dad? Are we gonna move on this? Or are we gonna keep paying the guys in the loading dock to play cards? I know it seems like a risk. I've never designed a collection before, but I'm your son. Fashion, fashion is in my blood. And we are in no position to sit back and just play it safe. I believe in this collection, and I only hope you believe in it as much to produce it. I do. <laughs> Welcome to the design team. Where's your... You don't realize what a precious gift I've given you. My freedom? My freedom from regret. I mean, Logan is still young. You are the moon and, and the stars to him right now. But when he gets older, he may feel differently about you because of father's relationship with his son. Oh, it can be so difficult. He may do things. He may say things to you that will make you wonder what you did wrong. But, but kids are supposed to they learn by example. And the best way for me to teach Logan to be happy is for me to be happy. And I have never been happier than I am with you. I want to feel that way again, Jackie. I, I want to wrap my arms around you at night, and I want to wake up in the morning beside you. I want to welcome you home from work the way that I used to. Isn't this can all go back to the way that it was? Something about these. Yes, they're beautiful. <laughs> no, no, there's something else. You know, they're really, they're really quite extraordinary. I had no idea he had any talent as an artist. Really? <laughs> I guess I, am I the only one that's surprised by this um, sudden aptitude for design? <sighs> what happened? They like the designs? No. They love them. Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, whoa! They're gonna use them! It's going into production immediately. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? And Ridge, he, he didn't want to change anything? He, he, he liked them that much? Yeah, Ridge wasn't there. He's on his way back from Mexico with Steffi. Wait, but he's the CEO. My dad made the call. Eric, approve my design. He said that they were impressive. Oh, wow. Rick, Rick, oh, 
You don't even know what this means to me. Being back in it again, a designer. I mean, Forrester Creations. I mean, of course, no one will know. You'll get all the credit, but I will know. Rick, this collection, it is gonna be huge. I mean, everyone is gonna be talking about Forrester's new Renaissance man, and Rich, you better watch his back. All right, hey. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Why not, huh? This is your dream, controlling Forrester Creations. And we are gonna make it happen, Rick. Today just proves it. I mean, together, we can do anything. Come over here. Now. What? You think I'm being hard on you? You told me to drop it. Let's drop it. Let me tell you what's hard. Listening to my son gripe about his vacation while Ridge worries about his daughter's well, you, health. You think I'm not worried about Steffi? I don't want anything to happen to her. Then you know what you have to do. Steffi made a mistake. She'd be the first to admit it. And she has. She's apologized. It's over. Okay, you are my father, you are my boss, you are not my priest or my shrink, and you don't get to have an opinion about how things work in my marriage. It's gotta stop. You know, I don't even think I want to send Steffi home with him. All right, look, he's a hothead. Can't imagine where that comes from. But he'll settle down. As soon as we get him to cut his ties to hope once and for all. He really thinks I don't care. Of course you do. I can't ignore what Steffi did. Well, she needs you right now. She's sick, and if she gets upset... I know. I know. Then let it go. You have to. And after Aspen, Steffi promised me, she promised me she would never lie to me again. She's your wife, Liam. In sickness and in health. Yeah, well, I still have questions. The answers won't change.